Today's video comes right out of the pages of a soap opera. This has to be the worst case of unaccountability that I've ever seen. What's going on everybody? How you doing today? It's your man here, Jackson's Gambit, with another video for you. So, we have a woman who was driving intoxicated, lost control of her car, and then got into an accident. Now, as this story goes along, you're gonna realize that homegirl seems to be hiding something. She's okay now. Ma'am. Baby. Ma'am. Baby. Baby, huh? Well, this guy's not a cop. I mean, I'm assuming from the basketball shorts. So this man must be her boyfriend. I'm outside. Got to open the door, kid. Priscilla, you got to come out. Ma'am. Ma'am, are you injured? Are you okay? Ma'am, are you injured? <laughs> Ma'am, are you okay? injured? Baby, I got to the door. Are you okay? He's got his hands on her arms. He's consoling her. Yeah, I think this guy might be the boyfriend. I am, but I need to. Ma'am, step to the back of the car, please. Ma'am. Ma'am. Come to me. Come to me. I'm the police officer. Ma'am. 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 Nope, not doing that. Whoa, 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 whoa! If this man's the boyfriend, then why is he running off like that? And she's acting all frantic. She don't want to talk to the cops. She goes and hides in her car. I think you know what I'm putting down. Something, something, something right. Ma'am, can you step out, please? No, I'm not going to step out. I don't feel safe, so shut the fuck up! Ma'am, step out, please. Ma'am, step out, please. Ma'am, step out, please. Off to a rousing start. Disrespecting and yelling at the cops that are just there to help you figure out what happened. Maybe you need some medical attention, but no, you want to talk like that? It's going to be a long night. Please. Joseph, I don't want anything, please. I fucked up my car. I fucked up my car. They don't care. They're being assholes. I'm sorry. I didn't realize me asking you, ma'am, ma'am, what happened? What happened? Talk to me. Did you hit anything? Do you need any medical attention? Is me being an asshole. I think the only person being an asshole in this situation is you. Your boys got real deep there. You sure your ass ain't possessed? There is no being a holy soul. It's like she goes from bitter to sweet. Just like that. I'm next to my car. Crocodile tears. How much you have to drink tonight? I'm in front of the CVS pharmacy. How much you have to drink tonight, nurse? Fuck you! I got a salt to you, piece of shit! By who? Yeah, okay, whatever. Yeah, whatever. If we started with that, we wouldn't have a problem, would we? You know what? Fuck off! You don't know who I am! Well, yeah, technically she is right about that. Because you're not telling the cops anything. And I'm sorry, but who cares who you are? Hands raised. Anyone? Anyone? She got chased by an ex. We were at my place. We came outside. I was going to drive for home. We got a wedding tomorrow. I can show you the dress. Dating? Yeah, we're dating. We're looking to get engaged. So this is the boyfriend slash white zaddy, Joseph, who she was on the phone with. But if that's the boyfriend, then who was the guy here at the beginning of the video? And I saw this guy, I taped it up, I know it's been threatened by a former, two, th two different stalkers. One is a former NYPD. And that's why I said, fuck it, I'm putting my fucking camera on, I choose my life. What a dork. Dude, put your phone down. And am I the only one that noticed that she wasn't treating that dude like a stalker after that car crash? 
She seemed very content and comfortable around that guy before he ran off. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Priscilla, yes, sir. I never met him, but I can tell you that he filed. No, it's got. Honey, you can't live this way. No, you can't live this way. I'm begging you to stop. She's afraid. Jesus, She's afraid to kill listen her. to me. Stop it. No, I no. need information. I'll call your brother. No. I'm calling your brother. He doesn't. He, he, I'm Joseph. No, stop. Priscilla, this is beyond the point. You got to Joseph, stop. No, honey. Stop it's Valerie Wife said you're stop home it. syndrome. Stop. I'll get you stop. a letter. We're we'll working on something. No, stop. no. Stop. I'm begging you to stop. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm begging not. you to stop. No, but you can't. He, no. A deal. No. Oh, yeah. Joseph, please. Oh, I don't want anything. No, nothing. Did you get a plate? Listen there was no plate on the front of the car. But you can, I'll, you can, you can look at the car. Okay. We'll get that from you. We'll get that from you. No, it's, no, it's not. I mean, honey, this is bad. Look at my face. My face is bad. I mean, honey, you can't live that way. You can't live in fear of people. Her parent, her father's a preacher stop on Walker Street. Stop has a stop it. No, we're not. Stop. 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 She's afraid stop. of the stop. repercussions. Big, big. No, stop. she's not going to work. I'm sorry. I'm not sure she's been drinking tonight. It's fine. But she was, I, I, I really, I can show you her dress on the thing. I was driving her home. We were leaving her car. And we came out and his car was there. Stop and then, I mean, that's why, like, I'll press charges. So this guy's a stalker, but when your boyfriend says that he's going to press charges against him, you're telling him not to do it? Let's call a spade a spade. Bitch was cheating on her main dude, Joseph, with that side piece. Have a seat. Have a seat. So, seriously? Y'all should have been did that. I don't know why y'all let that woman carry on as long as she did. Disrespecting you, not answering any of your questions, not cooperating. Now you decide to put her in that cop car? Come on, y'all. I don't know. She's been stalked by two people. I. She does not want me to know who the one is because she's afraid I'm going to take care of her. And she doesn't want me to get in trouble. She's like, I love your mom. I love your family. This or that. Let me handle it. And her dad's, her dad's a preacher. And she feels like she's the black sheep of the family and she's like that. Look, you can come up with any type of excuse you want to for this woman, but the bottom line is, you getting played for a sucker, my guy. Clearly she's using that other dude for the sex and excitement and using your ass for your finances. Do not be a Joseph, all right? Take care of yourself. Take care of your body, eat right, stay in the gym. Not every woman out there is like her, but it's up for you to decide which one is which. Cause they're not gonna tell you. Men and women, please be careful out there. Know who you're dealing with, please. But that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed today's content. Have a good rest of your day and I'll see you tomorrow in the next one. All right, later days y'all, peace.